There are many possible door configurations for an electronic access control system. In this module, we present one possible configuration in order to provide you with a foundational understanding of the hardware involved in a typical door configuration. Specifically, we provide you with an overview of common hardware in a basic door configuration and other hardware you may see in door configurations. After completing this lesson, you will be able to identify the key physical components of a basic door configuration. In the image to the right, the door configuration includes the following components, a controller, a door, a siren, a push to exit button, a door contact, a reader, a token, and an electric strike. Although we reviewed common hardware found in a basic door configuration, there are many other types of readers, inputs, and outputs. We discuss a few other types here. Usually, readers take the physical form of card readers, but they are not limited to this form. Readers can be fob readers, pin readers, or even biometric readers such as fingerprint scanners. A door contact is a common input device, but there are many others. For example, push to exit buttons, motion sensors, and floor sensor mats also send information to the controller. A siren is a common output device, but it's not the only one. Output devices allow for the turning on of a light, the automatic opening of a door, the activation of a revolving door, and more. To sum up, a basic door configuration is usually comprised of an access control point, a controller, and its associated reader, inputs, and outputs. In our example, our reader was a card reader. Our inputs included a push to exit button and a door contact, and our outputs included a siren and an electric strike. Additionally, Identities generally require a token to access the door, which in our example was a card. However, there are many types of readers, inputs, and outputs, which we overviewed at the end of this module.